Hey guys, what's up? This is um, Cameron from AppOSX.com and today I'm going to be showing you how to install iOS 4, the final version, before its release date, which is of course June 21st. So to do this, um, well let's first start off that I'm using a Windows PC, however to do this it is required that you use a Mac, so I'm going to show you how to do it on a Mac from a Windows PC. And I'll basically show you how. So um, you have to have a Mac and you have to have an internet connection. Um, and by the way, this dock down here is Object Dock. It's a great piece of software that you can get for Windows. So what you need to do is um, first you need to download iTunes 9.2, which I will give you a link in the description. Um, it's right here. You don't have to really read that, but you need to download and install that or your Mac operating system Mac uh, hardware. Um, once you've installed iTunes 9.2, you then need to look in the description, find your device. Um, iPhone 2G and iPod Touch 1G are not supported, so don't ask in the comments. But um, you need to find your device, go to the Mega Upload uh, uh, link, and type in the thing and download it. Um, keep your download where you know it will be. Um, I'm not sure where they go on Macs. I'm pretty sure they go in the downloads folder but save it to your desktop, whatever. So uh, once you have iTunes 9.2, you're going to need to, uh, here we go, you're going to need to plug your iDevice, iPhone 3G, whatever. Um, I'm using the one that I'm recording into your computer. Um, obviously, you also have iTunes open. Um, Hopefully it doesn't start syncing. I'll try canceling it. I don't want it to. Um, wait for it to recognize. Give my old computer a second here. Okay. You made the didoot sound. Um, okay, here's this autoplay thing. Okay, so um, so now that you have your device plugged into your computer, you need to go select your device, Cameron's iPhone, and on Macs, I'm pr almost positive it's Alt, hold Alt, and click Restore. On Windows, it's Control, but uh, you cannot do this on Windows, guys. Don't try it. You need iTunes 9.2, and it will not restore or update no matter what you do. So you're going to hold it, hit Restore. Um, my bad. Yes, on Windows it's uh, Shift Restore. And once you have that, you'll bring up this dialog. You'll go to wherever you have your IPSW saved. Um, I'm not going to select one. Click it, and um, it'll start restoring to that. Now, the good thing about this iOS is that there's no UUID registration required. This is the final version. This will be what's going to be available to download on June 21st has no expiration date. I highly recommend that you download it. Um, once it's done, you'll have the multitasking if you're running a newer device, and if not, you'll have the all the 4.0 features. So, yep, that's it. Please rate, comment, and um, please subscribe. It really helps our channel. We're trying to get some some subscribers going here for our new channel. So it'd be greatly appreciated for new uh, app reviews, news. Um, whatever's going on in the Apple world, we'll put some videos up. So um, that's it. This is Cameron. Peace out.